Previously on Infraspace. After our last successful spaceship repair, we have been hired again with the added challenge of terraforming the planet. We made landfall and JD did what he does best, went straight into overproduction. You name it, we overproduced it, maybe just a little bit too much. Suburbia was built, oxygen, food, water, home appliances, computers, parks and stadiums were provided, and finally we maxed out the skyscrapers with higher education and VR edutainment. I'm so glad they don't need healthcare, with JD having a giant laser he can swing about. The spaceship is being repaired, just a few parts to go. But when it's finished, can we please get the hell out of here? Trains were built, stations placed, micro factories were planned, and spaghetti rails became the norm. With the power of industrial robots and now AI technology, we started replacing the workforce, opting for a more automated approach to our terraforming efforts. Remember, for every like on the video, we get an extra robot, and you can click subscribe for more. G'day, mate, and welcome back to Infraspace with me, Jitty. And yes, I risked it. I risked it, I risked it, and it's in some more houses. Another row of houses. Just one row of houses because, well, um, remember how we're at 1850? people and then we started making the industrial robots and, and, and cut down on the people when well then then I am um, um um well well okay they all got added at the same time they all got upgraded at the same time uh well then I went and um added a bit more production so uh last episode we were working on uh adding in another set of nanotubes for some more neural processes they are both done uh because we now have the ai control units now the ai control units don't actually go into anything currently which is good because um well they needed the neural process plus they need aluminium ore aluminium ore we grabbed from the brand new aluminium train station which just dumped it literally onto the same train network we've got going sort of everywhere and just told the train to go a to b and it hopefully solved that solved us solved that problem uh what's on that one Neural processes. Why neural processes? Oh, oh, okay. Because, yep, yeah, neural processes go into both of these. All right. At the same time, I also, uh, over here, we had two dedicated uh, nanotube factories, which I figured, you know what? Let's have uh, two dedicated neural processor factories right beside it. But uh, the difference being this time around, rather than dedicate the nanotubes to go in there, uh, whoops, sand is dedicated to go in there because I had to up sand production. Uh, and, and water and, and what's the other one? Water and carbon. Carbon goes in the carbon nanotubes. Of course, um, they're dedicated, but the nanotubes can either go into the neural processes or, as this truck just proved, go anywhere else. Sand is still taking a while to uh, build up and stockpile and get into these builds, but they seem to be working. Uh, of course, that also meant I needed more microchips. Microchips need to come from, well, the microchip plant, uh, which led to this train station getting a tiny upgrade with um, some, some, some rails, some rails. We don't question some of these ramps. These ramps are fine, but um, yes, got some rails to bring across our microchips into this factory to then run these guys, which then hopefully gives us finally enough of the neural processes because neural processes are needed for yellow science and can't we're doing science um also these also need nanotubes they'll get nanotubes eventually uh we now have access to the high-tech workshop and uh that means we're gonna go and unlock red science uh at the same time i said it was about time it was about time we upgraded the bridge which gives us a permanent five percent immigration boost uh, yeah, there's 1,600 looking for a house that I don't have access to. Um, so I don't think that 5% immigration boost is going to really help us now. Uh, but we now have access to the high-tech workshop, which needs, holy crap. Um, it needs methane, that's not an issue. It needs some of those neural processes, that could be an issue. Uh, also needs aluminium. Uh, let's start with, uh, well, actually, we have all those items right here. We have all those items right here. Uh, aluminium does not come into this train station, but it's literally right there. Okay, so that just means iridium alloy, which is, well, over here. 
Okay, we've got a plan. We've got a plan. At least I've got a plan. Uh, plan is to find that build. All right. Uh, and methane. Methane, we can just pipe over here. That's not really an issue. Okay. So a high-tech workshop is going to give me a high-tech tool. High-tech tool will go in here and increase... Oh, production by 30%. That's actually significant. Uh, is it significant enough that we're going to build a few of these? Probably. Uh... Do I prioritize one side over the other, or what are we going to do here? And we now have access to red science. Okay, let's let's stop and look at what red science needs. Red science needs... Yeah, chips we just made. Plus they need explosive boom booms and they need yellow science. Okay, all right. Let's do some uh, red science. At least then we can start the process running. Um, yes, yes. Uh, I don't actually care if these guys get a bonus or not all right we're going to slide you over here and you over here and i'll take a bonus i take a bonus if i can get a bonus uh can i slide you yeah edge on please uh edge on the other direction uh It seems there might not be power here. Can I throw a substation right about here, please? And just hook it in the power grid? Cool. Uh, just out of my way. Uh, these ones are moving because it means any vehicles that are on their way won't suddenly get lost and deleted. Uh, you rotate and you rotate. All right, uh, science, 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 science. Can I get a, another one? No, okay. Can I rotate you around that way and you get road access? Yes, okay. You uh, plus you and you and you and you and lab can get moved over here instead. And we can go there 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 and not there okay can you go one tile one tile one tile all right so you guys are going to need ai control units we'll have to find those you need radiation cores now radiation cores we made right here whether we have enough production or not i have no idea production overview radiation cores not quite uh but that's okay and uh, i guess i need to expand this district out to cover those guys and definitely cover these guys yeah okay uh all right radiation cores one thing uh yellow science separate thing and then finally the ai control units now the ai control units uh are here Fine enough i make enough of them i was not expecting that so ai control units are incredibly expensive uh if i bring back up production overview districts and i click on this this uses 42, 42 of the neural process, processes. Um, one of these lines only does 37 neural processes. So I was actually really concerned about how much we would produce and therefore how much we'd need and there, 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 blah, blah, blah. But if this is only used for science, we should be fine. Uh, can I run a highway to here, to here, to here? And that puts those in the network. And they're leaving. Where are you going? You're going on to a train, which is then going up to that station and then down to this station. Getting off and going for a great jaunt all the way through that mess and into there. Not ideal, uh, but I'll allow it. Because it's science, it doesn't run terribly fast. It will do. Uh, your train station, Lamba. Train station, Lamba moves VR edutainment VR Lamba to Delta so it does have a direct train it's just chosen to take a more roundabout method but that's fine okay so that's that problem sorted uh next problem being these guys so these guys are going to need to have in magic ore plus they need to have aluminium uh, and a methane. Okay, so let's do methane first, because that's the really complicated one. Uh, we're going to run a pipe 
from there to there to uh, there. Okay, JD, stop laying in long bits of pipe. You gotta, you, you gotta keep your piping to a reasonable amount of pipe. Okay, cancel that overlay. Come on. And you all have me think. Great. All right, step number one completed. Uh, step number two, let's draw up a district so we can look at our totals. Uh, close and production overview district. Uh, that is using 15. And you, in theory, make 45. Okay. Uh, all right. In that case... And you need how many of the purple rods? 15. And we make, uh, well, not enough. All right, we'll worry about that after we work out how to get them here. Uh, close, close. All right, so purple rods. Uh, can I get more of the high-tech workshops? Okay, not in that orientation. Uh, can I slide you, let's go right. High tech workshop there, there. It looks like it's making a calculator. Cool, we'll call that enough. All right, I need to get aluminium. Aluminium is right there, and I think. Yeah, I think we're just gonna take a highway. It just seems easier. Uh, okay, highway, single lane from there. Press F a lot so it's nice and high. Run it from there to there, too. Uh. Can I go under that bit? I can go under that bit. Okay, so go to there and then into That's a fairly busy intersection already, so we'll dump the aluminium in there. Great. Now, with that done, I should be able to scroll over here and see a bunch of trucks. There's none available, none available, none available, none 40 available. Okay. Four available, 29, 24. Trucks? 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 Districts. Aluminum. Yep, you're not told to export anywhere. Uh, you're not running at all, actually. Are you not connected to the road? I so put you over there. Okay. You can go that way. And get to there. Which gets to, it, it 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 is it is aluminium. Can I be delivered? 40. Okay. It's probably going on a great roundabout train track, right? Yes, that's probably correct. Okay. But iridium alloy, none has been delivered. All right, so we need to go get iridium alloy, which is... Yeah. Iridium alloy requires nanotubes. Now, we already have a nanotube production line running. And if I check on this, we are making uh, 111. And we're using 76. So I sort of need more nanotubes. Okay, what we're going to do uh, as an interim is... Main road, uh, you are three tiles deep. So I'm going to put a road from here to here. And then, uh, where's processing for iridium? It's that building. Uh, we're just going to dump out a pile of iridium factories. Yes, okay. Uh, which then, districts, I will have to increase this because I know these nanotubes are marked for just this district. Uh, I don't think the ore is at all. <sighs> Turn district tool off. Put that there. Turn district tool on. Remove that. Gosh. Go go away. All right. Uh, well, even if you were, you should be fixed. All right. So you guys should be able to get whatever nanotubes we have available from this. But... Our iridium alloy also needs to go into making radiation cores to make science work. Yep. 
an AI control unit should be on a train somewhere getting over here. Uh, actually, can we just double check? Uh, currently, we deliver 40, 40, 40, 40. 40. Forty. Now, everyone that gets uh, forty deliveries is going to give us well. It's, it's three, um, three AI cores per science, so we're going to get what eleven science out of each one of these. Uh, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine times eleven is I don't know enough. Hopefully, you still have. You you just suck at getting motors. All right. Uh, research. In that case, uh, I think we should do the fertilizer train up um because we can't really do red science yet um we're gonna have to wait for these to actually get supplied and then dropped over there in the meantime we can get some uh some other research done all right so with that done and that done hopefully uh yeah you guys see me running fine laser factory is great water will get there eventually i i, I never ever built on top of the ore you, you, you saw nothing hang on Yep, didn't build on top of the ore at all. Uh, that'll solve that problem. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh, all right, what else do we have to do? Uh, okay, so we need to get Iridium bars here. Now, I could truck them across, or I could have a train to this station. Uh, let's go with a train. So we're going to go with rails. Can I get a, up a few tiles around and back in? I don't really want to use that track, actually. I want to use that track first. All right. Uh, we're going to come... Huh? I made a perfect loop. Why are you already set up like that? I don't... Yep. No idea. Okay. Uh, Iridium. So Iridium is here. This tool and actually get a loading station. Please agree with me, game. Yep, that's just me removing the tool from my hand. That's double right clicking. Yep. Yep, like I said, uh, I did mention earlier, I am pushing the engine to its absolute limit. Uh, and I'm not improving things with me continuing to add more production and add more housing and add more traffic flow. All right, uh, that's our train station. So we're going to go with a loop-de-loop. -loop. Uh, like... What? I somehow put the train tracks under the station. All right, that's the first, even for me. All right, uh, put you back there. Cool, and it hooked up to the right track. Yeah, the, the, the right road. Okay, we're going to go with train track there to there, uh, which then needs to... Where do I leave that track? Uh, we're going to come to, I figure about here. Yep. Sorry, JD. Short train tracks, short train tracks. Yep. And then plug that in there and bring that up to there-ish. And same height. Mm, nope. Down one. Cool. All right. And then roughly not rubbing over your own track. Yep, there. And then there. And then through the middle. And can I just do that as one giant track or... Sure. I have a feeling the tracks crossed. Yeah, they did, but um, surely the train's very short and you can slide under that. Yeah, I think so. All right, so I need to go train line. Uh, this is iridium. Uh, purple. Come on. 
Oh, it, it had a lag. Me just adding a train. Oh, yeah. All right. Purple. Uh, obviously needs to be a train color of purple. Uh, from here to here. One train. Okay. So with that done, you can now get off the train and head into these lanes, which means you should be able to get into these machines. Your aluminium is still on its way somewhere. Haven't been carrying aluminium? No. Where the hell did it go? So I had to leave here possibly by train to go not into there, not into there, not into there. 12 aluminium there. It's a different track entirely. Yeah, spaghetti rails. Uh, I don't think the game likes me. And I also have no idea where this missing aluminium is. nothing carrying new old processes it's on its way oh oh that's had its aluminium delivered okay so some of them have been delivered well the highway would be so much quicker but i haven't seen a single truck on it all right uh you're going back to get purple stuff and how much purple stuff do we have at this end? We have 300. Okay. So we have 300. These guys should be firing up. 86% efficiency. Yeah. We're having a population problem. Uh, in fact, I think it's going down again. No, it's going back up. Yeah, this is the problem. When I add something, just, just the smallest thing, we then have a situation where, oh, look, there was a shortage of good meals. I double check the overlays. Uh, good meals. Nope. We still have a production of what? A lot. A lot. A lot too much. Filter mesh production consumption. Why? Oh, because I'm short on people. So all the percentages are doing cool percentage things. All right. Well, in that case, how's this factory going? Because this replaces people. Uh, okay. They don't have extra industrial robots, which means they're not maxed out. Um, the industrial robots are still finding somewhere to go to, well, do industrial robot things. And, oh, I want, I want, yeah, I want to see one of these guys run. Uh, okay, so where's my purple train? Purple train, 308 iridium which should drop off here and exit all to left, which means I should probably... No, it should be right. Yeah, everybody goes left. Everybody hits the molasses main road. Uh, our, our aluminium would come in there if anybody bothered and disappear into these guys. Apparently I've been delivered 16, 16, 20, 24, 28, 36, 36. Okay, and any of the early ones that get stuff is useless to me because, well, they don't have any menu. All right, machines and factories are running. Inverse GBHM, one of the major, uh, major sponsors of Infraspace. Obviously, they have their branding on a whole bunch of the buildings. Uh, and now I can't find one. Who's this? Uh, Billion Worth Corp. Okay. Uh, Future Gen Tech. Uh, that's another VA7 Technologies. It's a couple of uh, major industrial partners. All right. So this should give us a different purple thing. A different purple thing being the high-tech tools. Now, you're going to go up there. Oh, my God. What? You're going to get on that train. You're then going to go uh, off on a train ride from here to 
to here to come back to here to then go in there. Oh boy, uh, I need to have uh, a single lane exit to go to, I guess there, technically. Except I want you to do that, and I want you to do that, and I want you to do that one, the other one do that one. Oh, 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 it's our first. It's our first. Hey, you're gonna go to here. All right, so currently efficiency of 152. Where's that truck? Come on, come on, trucky, trucky. Now, the other thing is if every building's efficiency is increased by 30%, it means their output, in theory, if, if everything's done on the production line and the chain is also increased by 30%, which also means that there's 30% extra traffic on the road, which is where you get into the complications. Uh, 152, 197. So height, how do we go from 152 to 197? What? What? 3215. 3215. 30, 30 is 60, plus 15 equals uh, 75, plus 2 is 77. Yeah! Even that, like, like 32 and 15 equals 152. It doesn't equal 152. Hey! See, perfect example. Uh, so you have all the boosts in the world, except Industrial Robot, and currently have no microchips. Now, I'm hoping that they don't count down in percentage, like it doesn't use the high-tech tools whilst the machine's not running, because that would be horrible. Uh, but yes, the biggest thing I'm now worried about is the 30% extra traffic on the road and the fact, oh, 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 that's an aluminium truck, perfect. And that is a shit ton of aluminium that came off a train from somewhere. Like I said, I got no idea how it went around the world, but in theory, now we have high-tech tools which should raise overall efficiency by 30%, hopefully. Uh, hopefully. Yeah. Yeah. Um, which should raise up everything. But, uh, drone fertilization is still taking its time. And we have four red science, four red science, four red science. And future red science is... 180, 350, 200, and spaceship is at 91 out of 100. Please tell me you have parts. Uh, you have four parts. Oh no, it's four. Oh no, it's one each. Yeah, so we have all the parts in here ready to go to launch. We just need to build them. And you're now back to recovery. Yep, so we just need the good meals. Fill what? Fill additional needs. All the needs are filled. Upgrading. There we go. Okay, so you guys are in the process of re-upgrading. And this is this is the catch. This is the danger. This is what I was talking about. When I added housing before, everything died. And even this housing I just added, it, I, I did add it, like some of it, a big chunk together and some of it piecemeal. And we just have so many problems. Why are we going into two lanes? Hey, repair your spaceship and re-establish contact with human civilization. What's coming next will be revealed during Infraspace's early access. For now, you can keep building your city and make it great. Well, in the theory, that means um, we're finished. We're finished with Infraspace, uh, which means this is as good a point as any for me to leave this video here. Will there be more in space? I don't know. You will have to uh, like the video, hit the subscribe button, and leave me a comment below. What else would you like to see in this series? Are we gonna continue this series? And with that said, I'll leave this video here. So as always, thank you guys so much for watching. Do hope you've enjoyed. I'll see you in possibly the next episode. If not, there's always more things on the channel, including uh, new games starting the next couple of days. Anyway, with all that said, uh, I'm out. Thanks for watching. See you next one. Bye.